Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. This is Vijay, and I represent Hover. Before I start, I would like to get a bit of a context of the audience. Uh, can I have a show up of the ladies? Can I have? Can you raise your hands, please? Okay. Sad. Uh, that accounts to less than 10% of the total audience. But ironically, the product which we have built uh, is not going to cater to the rest of the 90% of the audience. That's a bad way to start a demo. So uh, let me put it in this way. Uh, how many of you in the room uh, have a girlfriend or a wife? Uh, can you please raise your hands? Uh, any gentleman with both? Uh, Okay, uh, I think uh, now it's got a pretty interesting, we've got a good market. I give you a chance to make them happy. Uh, so, before I start, uh, I'm pretty sure uh, a lot of people know who she is, uh, I guess. So, uh, suddenly she's not your girlfriend or your wife, and uh, our product is not going to help you to uh, get her as your girlfriend. Uh, but what we do is we help your girlfriends or wife to get a look. So we provide lookalikes from e-commerce stores which looks exactly similar to what she's wearing. Don't worry if your girlfriend is going to look like this also. Fine, we'll help you. So there are thousands of celebrities who are like this and there are millions of followers who follow them and billions of photographs that have been shared on the web. So, Hover is a technology platform that helps you to shop through the celebrity and the fashion photographs that are being shared on the web. So, ever spotted a celebrity wearing an awesome cloth and wanted to buy the same but had no clue where to buy it from? You don't have to worry anymore. So, this is a famous uh, Indian lifestyle fashion magazine or website. So, you spot a celebrity wearing an awesome cloth. You just need to you just need to, I think uh, he fell because looking at this lady. Uh, so you just need to hover over the image and you get to see our logo. Click on our logo and you get to see instant results from e-commerce stores which looks exactly similar to what she's wearing. And you click on it, you'll be taken to the e-commerce store and you can buy it from there at once. How do we do that? We don't have a bunch of people sitting and tagging the products with the images, but we have taken a programmatic approach to solve this problem. We have built a computer vision algorithm that scans the entire image and compares with the database of more than one lakh products to provide you with the results in less than 0.12 seconds. That's a high-end computer vision stuff. So we provide it as a tool to the publishers. We don't aggregate any celebrity pictures in one particular website and ask you to come over there and check the pictures, but we go to the place where the pictures are there. So we provide it as a tool to the publishers like Yahoo, India Times, Men's XP, and Bollywood. So uh, they publish these kind of celebrity and fashion photographs where the visitors are already there and redirect them as a potential lead to the e-commerce retailers. That's a product. But that is not the only problem which we solve. The real problem lies here. Indian e-commerce industry was a $32 billion industry in 2012, and it's going to be a $100 billion industry in 2015. According to that, the e-commerce companies spend around 20 to 25% of their spends in advertising and customer acquisition. Companies have spent totally around like 600 crores in the year of 2012 and 13 in display advertising. What did it happen? What happened to that? If you look at this, this is the same website which I showed you. You see banner ads. So the publishers have to choke their visitors with these kind of banner ads. I'm sure everybody would have seen this. Anybody who is interested, who is pumped, ooh, ooh, I need to click on a banner ad. Anybody? Have you ever clicked on a banner ad? Anybody? No. Because it doesn't provide any value for you. And it is annoying. Many times you see an ad like this, which is irritating and it is intrusive. It, it affects the flow of an online user. But still the publishers do it. 
they provide engaging content to their users but still they have to choke their visitors with display ads because they don't have any other model to make money that's the only revenue stream which they have okay does it make sense for the advertisers no if you look at the numbers at comscore 16% of the internet users account to 80% of the display advertising clicks that's insane do we have a right future no a recent stanford survey shows that if you are age 24 or less than that you're fundamentally wired not to look at the right side of the website this is a recent eye tracking research which was done by the stanford university students you don't look at anything that looks like an advertisement anything because you're wired not to look at it but still companies spend so much of cash so how are we solving this problem however provides publishers help publishers to monetize the images which they upload it provides value to the end user as an instant buy option and thus creating value and thus they make money and have a highest retention rate of the users as a retailer you get a highly targeted audience because the end user did not click on a display advertisement by mistake and come to your page but he made three instances to land in your page he hovered over the image he clicked on the logo and he saw results out of which he chose you to come that shows he has the highest intention of buying the product so thus you get a brand engagement and highest return on investment comparing to the other models as a end user you don't have to search anything you just have to hover over the image so thus hover acts as a platform that connects the publishers retailers and end users at one single place providing value to all the stakeholders involved in the business so we launched at techrunch bangalore on 15th november and we have scored around the top publishers in india which includes mans xp style file and the fashion most, most wanted you'll see soon see images just hover over the images and get to get the look so we are a team uh for for this for, to be built we require an awesome team and our uh, team members are from indian institute of science to plight had about all reputed institutions and work experience from amazon redbus finisar and other big corporations we dropped out of that and been with startups for the last 2 years and uh, yeah that's what we do <laughs>